Okay, happy new year to everybody. This video is going to go up right before the second day of the new year. Um, I'm here to talk about the game. We all just watched the Ravens versus Steelers on Sunday Night Football. It was a great battle, I think. Um, the Ravens did lose, though. They straight up lost the game. 16-13. Kenny Pickett turned into Jesus himself in the final drive. Went down the field, scored a touchdown to Najee Harris in the end zone. There's a lot of point. There's a lot of points I can go into context in this game. I only got five minutes here because I got this video up before 12 a.m. Because I'm going to try to post every single day of the new year, which is going to be hard. <laughs> We're going to try. Um, I'll get into that in another video, probably coming up soon. Um, but I'm going to be on phone for the rest of this week, starting tomorrow, and I will be on computer next weekend. So. Here's how I'm dealing right now with this game. I just watched it. I went crazy. It was so fun to watch, but it was so sad at the end. Sometimes you just got to win games, and the Ravens can't do that. They play. They win three quarters. There's a lot of work to be done for us to have a realistic shot at a playoff run. Right now, it's looking like we're going to get the sixth seed. We can't get the seventh seed because the Dolphins lost. So we're realistically looking at a sixth seed, and we'll probably be in the jungle two weeks in a row. So... I think next week, knocks off the rust for Lamar, we'll probably lose. Knocks off the rust, and then the week after that, I mean, that's your only hope. You get Lamar into a rhythm in the first week of the playoffs, we can go on a playoff run and win the Super Bowl. Just saying. I mean, we've seen how the offense can play. We've seen how the defense can play at its greatest. Yeah, those two together, it's an easy, easy Super Bowl win. Even against Brock Purdy and the 49ers. I know. But I truly think that... Um, we, we did the best we could, and we did everything we could to win that game. It just never worked out. We got close at the end. Huntley stopped running the ball. JK stopped running the ball. It, it just stopped working for us. But I think next week we come out play the Bengals will probably lose our first probably lose our first back to back game in a row probably get my cousin here to talk I can see if I can get him on right now if he's online let me see he's on let's see if he'll join Okay, back to the video. I just, there's so many points I can point out in this game, but I want to start out with Isaiah Likely dropping the ball at the 40-yard line. That gives Justin Tucker a chance to make it 16-9. That gives us a chance to go out and go into overtime and win the game. I still don't think we would have won in overtime getting that Kenny Pickett so good. Um, I think Lamar is the piece that we're missing. I'm starting to get sad here because I just want him back. I just want him back. He's such an important piece to our team. And we need him back now. We do. Because we're not winning games without him. It's just that simple. Huntley, last year for his contract, he'll probably be gone next year. Yeah, that's my instant reaction, really. I, I have nothing to say. I have nothing to say. I have absolutely nothing to say about how our performance was to Adams Beaches in the fourth quarter. All right, let's check out some stats. I'll pull it up. I'll pull it up. Okay. Um, stats in this game. Pull it up for you guys. 
Stats in this game, Huntley, 14 for 20, 130 yards and a touchdown. It's great to see him throwing another touchdown pass. But again, J.K. Dobbins, he didn't get he didn't get 100 yards like we were expecting him to. Mark Andrews, he had a really good game. Kenny Pickett, 15 for 27, 168 yards and a touchdown. Najee Harris, 22 carries for 111 yards. Some more player stats. Um, receiving, George Pickens had a couple had only two receptions, but those two receptions won them the game. Um, defense, Mickey Fitzpatrick had the interception. However, T.J. Watt had a sack. That's it for sacks. Steven Sims Jr. had a return. The Raven side, Huntley played a little well. Gus Edwards only had three carries for two yards. Mark Andrews, we didn't, we suck. Our receivers just are bad. I can't say anything more about it. Brandon Stevens, any interceptions? No, any sacks? Yeah, we got some sacks. P JPP got a sack, which would have won us the game if he got it. Um, our kick returns, punt returns, James Crochet, one for two yards. Kick returns, two returns for 83 yards. Good return. But that's all I gotta say. I'm just so speechless. All right. I'm not out. I'll see y'all tomorrow for another upload. It'll probably be a quick one, just me talking about something. But yeah, see y'all. Peace.